Now, among the people paying the closest attention to this news in the community is around Fort Campbell. Many wondering if these events will lead to their friends, family and neighbors with that post being deployed. News Force Forrest Sanders headed to Fort Campbell Boulevard to hear what they're saying. Away from the wet and cold. You can find the heat in here. Hero Patel's part of the family tradition. Here is my sister. That's my dad, Jack. Hello. That's my brother, O. And then that's my mom. They run JP's Hot Chicken, the place with the fire breathing space chicken outside, and levels that run from southern mild, extra hot, super hot to true heat. We have a waiver just in case. We sign a waiver just so they know what they're getting into. That's a level of heat Hero won't do. No, no. I don't have the guts to. But being right across from Fort Campbell, soldiers will take that heat. Because it's all about the flavor. And Hero's family puts in the work to add the right sauces and spices to give that chicken a made-to-order kick. With all the businesses through here, a lot of the customers are made up of the men and women of Fort Campbell. And that's why everyone's paying attention to news of the airstrike in Baghdad. They're wondering what comes next and if soldiers here will deploy. We were here for that last deployment, and it really does affect the businesses here a lot. It impacts them because it is their duty to go and serve, but at the same time, it's kind of like we don't want to see them go from home. But for now, on this normal day of filling bellies and serving up heat, Hero wants the many faces in her dining room to know this. We absolutely thank you for protecting our country, and they are a part of our family, and we want them to know that. In Oak Grove, I'm Boris Sanders, News 4.